So a, a lot of the technologies that we're working on here um, are, are foundational, N not just for, for virtual reality, but also uh, for the future of what we want to do with augmented reality, too. And one of the really foundational things that, that we feel like we, we want to improve and make a lot better is input. Because in the future, you're going to be able to interact with digital objects with your hands, or just as naturally as you can with physical objects in, in, in the world. Now, I'm sure that a lot of you remember the first time that you, you tried out touch controllers, right? And how awesome it was. You were just able to you know, look down in, in virtual reality and reach out and grab something or throw it and do something with it. And, um, it really just added this whole element to, to the experience. But as soon as we made that possible, it immediately opened up this bigger question, which is, OK, how can we do even better? How can we make it so that instead of having to use hand controllers, we can just use our hands? And I am excited to announce that early next year, we're launching hand tracking on Quest. All right, want to see it? Let's, let's check this out. All right. So, so this means no controllers, no buttons, no straps, no external sensors, uh, just full range of motion in your hands. And you know, even if you've spent a lot of time in VR and you've spent a lot of time with touch controllers, uh, I think that the first time that you get a chance to experience this and you just wiggle your fingers and you, you see that, that full range of motion in your hands, it's, it takes the experience to a whole new level. And um, you're going to get a chance to try this out on the demo floor after the keynote today. So I'm really excited to, to, to get this into all of your hands.